Collections are essentially databases. They're where we store information that can get used in various places throughout our website. Not every website has or even needs a collections panel, but if yours does, here's how we can use it. When we pull up the panel, we'll see one or more names. Each of these is a collection. If we click on one, we can see all the items in that collection. So if we have a blog set up, the collection could be called blog posts, and inside is each blog post. Or maybe we have team members. Inside that collection is each of our team members. When we click on any collection, we see that tab show up right here. The point is, whatever the content, we can open up each of these to make changes. We can make changes to any of these fields. When we're done, we can save our changes. Or if we don't want to, we can cancel and none of our changes will be saved. Now, from the same collection, we can also search. We can search for items in our collection. We can also select, which is useful for grabbing things like multiple blog posts, and we can delete them. We can change their status to draft, which is great if we're working on something and don't yet want the world to see it. And we can archive. Archiving is like drafting in that it won't be visible on the website, but it's an extra indication that this item isn't a work in progress like a draft might be. For now, let's cancel. Finally, we can create a new item. We can simply fill out the details, fill out each of these fields. What you're seeing right now might appear like someone's a really fast typer. Her name is Stacy, and she's a really fast typer. Keep in mind, just like other changes we make in the editor, nothing will update on our actual site until we publish those changes. So if we're making something a draft, or creating a new item, or uploading a better photo, we have to publish for those changes to go live. And that's it. Collections can contain a lot of the content that's on our site for things like blog posts, team member pages. We can access and view or edit any items in each collection, and at any time, we can add a new item by pressing the new button. And that is the collections panel.